taken him a really long time, but he's doing a great job. He's been working on it every day because it's his passion. There was a glow to him and a joy about it that I, I had to know a little bit more. I mean, that's what clued me into it. Uh, I think it's a great project, and I'm uh, really impressed with how hard he works on it. I was about 22, and when 9-11 happened, I wonder why is the human race filled with so many wars? What are the causes of all this war and mass destruction? I actually said, why don't I reverse the question and ask myself, how can we finally find a solution to achieve everlasting peace? I saw this would be a great opportunity to make a painting that was screaming to say, no, the way to achieve real peace is, must be through unity, it must be through unconditional love, it must be through self-knowledge. I went ahead, closed the door, and just started to paint and paint non-stop. This project is probably one of the greatest works that I've ever seen. My goal was filling the house. So I started filling all the ceilings. I just started upstairs, my brother, my parents' room, my other brother's room, when the whole house was filled. And after that, my dad saw some ambition within, within me. So he started investing and said, okay, keep going, but this is 2,000 paintings. So I started painting and painting, basically a combination of 168 visions. And every master vision have nine paintings to fit the whole vision. And these are abstract paintings and when you look at individual paintings, you will see uh, faces representing people all around the globe. When you put all this painting together, like a puzzle, it becomes a half an acre painting of a peace symbol. It was perfect to actually choose all the territories around the globe that has a flag that represents that territory. I gather them all together, and that will turn to a contemporary peace sign. And then I noticed there is a ancient peace sign, and that is the white dove and the olive branch. There's a fragmentation to his paintings, but then when you put them all together, th there's a completeness to it. Every individual painting has a painting on the back side as well. When you turn them all around, you see the sun, all the nine planets circulating around the sun, and exclusively you will see the planet Earth covered with infinite love. The front side is called vision of unity. The back side is called vision of peace. People say, yes, it is a peace sign, but what you actually have put them together is a symbol of unity. And when they all become together, one, it becomes peace. And that was the message, was that in order to achieve peace, you have to apply unity. So I'm really excited about the prospect of it being displayed. Everlasting peace. That is the objective.